subscribers. I'm sorry about the sound. I'm gonna be. I have to. Tr I'm gonna try getting the new microphone because this one isn't that clear. It's basically for like internet calls, but um, I'm using it for this. So um, apologize for it's not catching up real well. Um, but uh, here I'm gonna show you a little trick to um uh, using AVSynth to um uh, basically make any of any of your videos comp play backwards, and you can even save them like that. So let's get to it. First, you need to install AVSynth. I have it um uh, already installed, and make sure you check every single detail. Every single detail, or it won't work that well. Trust me. Now, this is the final detail. Let's open it up. Delete it so I can show you step by step. Um, first, you want to write direct show and then source. change and it stays text document. You want to go to explore, tools, folder options, view, go to, it's, it, this is unchecked but it will be checked and then just check it off so it displays it. Now we just want to open this up. Oopsie. Now you can either view it as it but you can't upload on YouTube because they don't accept AV synth script because obviously it's on your computer and it won't work. But this is what it'll look like after you open it up in virtual dub and then uh, save it as an API. Or you can open it up in any other thing that supports uh, AV synth. See? And you can even add a lot of effects if you want. Let's see, I'm going to go to video just for fun. Let's add a little effect. I like gum. Um, Well, what I like is this. It's real cool. See how it changes? See? I really like that. It looks like ghosts. But, um, that's another day. Um, this has been a tutorial by Nico J. Malave. Basically, it's Malave Productions. I hope you, uh, really, that really helped.